Louisville, Kentucky, John Belathketh was in a familiar place, in the leaderboard Medina Spirit in the Kentucky Derby and holding off the stretch bid of three challenges. This time, Bob Baffett couldn't believe what he was seeing. Medina Spirit won by a half length on Saturday, giving Baffett his seventh victory, the most of any trainer in the race's 147 year history. The jockey and trainer, both Hall of Famers, teamed up eight months ago to win a pandemic delayed derby in September with Authentic, who raced to an early lead and hung on. That wasn't so surprising. Sent off at 12 to 1, astronomical odds for a colt trained by the white haired, two time Triple Crown winner, Medina Spirit was in a street fight thundering down the stretch. The dark brown colt was pressed by Mandaloon on his outside. Hot Rod Charlie was coming fast outside of Mandaloon, with 5 to 2 favorite essential quality giving chase on the far outside. I kept waiting for all those horses to pass him, Baffett said. When he got to the eighth pole, we said, this guy has got a shot. Belathketh knew he had plenty of horse left. We got to the 16th pole and he put his ears down and kept fighting, the jockey said. I was so proud of him. In the paddock, Baffert watched in amazement as one of the least heralded derby runners of his long career dug in at the front. You could tell he was laying it down and Johnny was riding hard, Baffert said. He was just relentless. Medina Spirit led all the way and ran one and a quarter miles in 201. 02, he paid $26, 20, $12 and $7, 60. The victory was worth $1, 86 million. Belathketh earned his fourth derby victory aboard the Colt that was purchased as a yearling for $1,000 and was a bargain basement buy at $35,000 last July for current owner Amra Zidin of Saudi Arabia. By comparison, Zidin recently paid $1, 7 million for an unraced two-year-old. He doesn't know how much he cost, Baffert said, but what a little racehorse. Baffert punched his right arm in the air after watching the finish on the video board. He was buried in celebratory hugs by his wife, Jill, and youngest son, Bode. Jill Baffett had reason to celebrate earlier, when a horse she co-owns and is trained by her husband won a $500,000 race on the undercard. I'm really, really surprised, the 68-year-old trainer said of Medina Spirit. It wasn't false modesty. Baffett had been low-key about his chances after two of his best horses, Life is Good and Concert Tour, were derailed along the Derby Trail. Medina Spirit isn't the typical high-priced talent with a fancy pedigree in Baffett's California barn. I cannot believe he won this race, the trainer said. That little horse, that was him, all guts. He's always shown that he's been an overachiever. His heart is bigger than his body. Medina Spirit has never finished worse than second in six career starts and two of his three losses came to life is good, who likely would have been the derby favorite had he not been injured.